What's up guys? So today I'm just doing a bit of an update for Night Wanderer, which will, you know, most likely be part of Shrouded Fable, our uh, SV 6.5 set that we get over here in uh, North America and the rest of the English world, like Europe and Australia. There's been some IR and an SIR card revealed, so I figured we'd go over it, plus some cool promos. Uh, the first thing up, Kingdra EX is getting a promo uh, in, a, in a Kingdra box, and we also get a uh, horsey IR card here that we can see. Really cool artwork. I love this uh, horsey, you know. Definitely not a fan favorite Pokemon, but definitely a cooler, uh, you know, older older Pokemon. Very cool artwork. Kind of reminds me of, like, the Squirtle from 151. I kind of get that type of vibe. So if that card's sitting around $20, maybe this will be somewhere between, uh, you know, 6 and $10, something like that. Maybe uh, the Kingdra EX card. Where is it down here? Uh, Petrant EX. I guess I'll just go over this one while I'm here. Uh, this is going to be an SIR card, I believe. Um, you know, again, not much to say. It's not a fan favorite Pokemon, but uh, pretty cool artwork nonetheless. I'm just seeing there's nothing to go over in that release. Uh, Duskull, um, the Duskull, Dusclops, and uh, Dusk Noir are all getting IR cards, so that's pretty interesting. Um, we'll just open these up here. Pretty cool artwork that kind of meshes together, sort of. Um, I do like the vibe of these, but again, I don't think they're going to be anything crazy these might be like you know two to five dollar cards maybe a bit more than that nothing super exciting then we have uh the kingdra ex which again is going to be a promo in uh the kingdra ex box very cool card right like uh, <laughs> i don't know I'm, I'm i'm kind of annoyed that they make such a cool artwork and they don't put it in the actual set they're making it a promo same thing with greninja we'll see here in a second uh, again, just really cool. I imagine if there's going to be some texture on this, it'll be a very interesting card. Um, but anyone else feel like they're just using way too many moons at this point? It just seems like in every frigging card that they're making now, there's going to be like a moon in the background. I don't know, like it, it's Kingdra, right? Like it's a water Pokemon and you still are finding a way to put a moon in. Um, they're obviously, you know, working with something where people really enjoy the moons or, you know, they're getting good feedback on it so they continue to do it. But Again, I think we're at the point where it's getting like a bit overused. That's just my opinion, though. Uh, but let's see if the Greninja one was in here. I don't think it was. Let's see. Maybe it was in this one. Yeah, here it is. So, uh, yeah, the Greninja EX for the Greninja box. Again, very awesome artwork. Not going to be part of the actual set. Kind of annoyed about that, but uh, we'll see. We'll see what SARs and IRs they give us. You know, I'm hoping that. Uh, the cards cut from uh, Twilight Masquerade aren't the other SIRs, the Monkey, Dory, Okie Dogie, and Fezzendipity. I hope those are just IRs and they give us something actually interesting as an SIR, but um, we'll, we'll find out here shortly. I mean, the set comes out in a couple weeks, I believe. But yeah, that's really all the cards we've gotten so far. So when it comes to the IRs, we have the Horsey and then we have the Dusk. Dusk Lops line uh, of IRs and then the SR. The only one we have confirmed is... Petrant, uh, again, you know, not a fan favorite Pokemon, but pretty interesting. So that's going to be in the video, guys. That's all we know about Night Wanderer now. Hopefully, we get a big update. We get some more releases in the coming days, and I'll, I'll give you guys another update once we have something big about the set. Because again, remember, Night Wanderer is the Japanese release, but it's likely going to be part of Shrouded Fable, which will be our SV six point five. Uh, if you guys found this interesting, if you could leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel, I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you guys for, you know, supporting the channel, whatever way you choose to do that. With that said, stay safe wherever you are in the world. I'll catch you in the next one.